Yo, what's good, YouTube? Welcome back to the channel. Today, guys, I'm going to show you the best Fell 46 class up that you need to be using right now here in Model for 2 Season 4. Now, hopping into our build, we are going to start with the barrel, which I'm going to be using the Tango 228 barrel. Now, this can help with damage range, hip fire accuracy, and bull velocity. Now, why I'm using this attachment is because up close, you really don't need to worry about the weapon. It's really good. Probably one of the best weapons up close in those gunfights. But once you start and get into those medium range and long range gunfights, this weapon turns into a pea shooter. I feel like every Everyone can agree with me this attachment here is going to prevent that the bullets are hitting harder traveling further traveling faster and if you need to hip fire the weapon has better accuracy so i mean i think this is a great attachment for our first one now, jumping into our second attachment, we're going to be going all the way over here and adding on the Spiral V3.5 Flash Hider. Now, this can help with muzzle flash concealment and recoil steadiness. The weapon's going to be more steady, be more accurate. Once you get into those longer ranges, you need more accuracy, recoil steadiness, keeping the weapon really steady and everything so you're hitting your shots, getting more kills, so you just don't have to take your engagements up close. Now, you can take them far to even super far, so I mean, this is a really helpful attachment here. Now, for our next attachment, we are going to the underbarrel, and we're going all the way over here to the last attachment, which is the Bruin Warrior Grip. It's going to help with hip fire accuracy, hip recoil control, aim walking steadiness, and recoil steadiness. Now, the only three things I'm really worried about here is that hip fire accuracy, hip recoil control, and recoil steadiness. The weapon has some good recoil control. We're just going to keep the weapon really steady now, and also if we need a hip fire, this weapon is super easy to hip fire. You don't even need to hip fire. I mean, or aim down sights. This weapon, you can either aim down sights or or hip fire you're gonna be very accurate you're gonna be getting your kills and everything so we are gonna be adding this attachment on now jumping down to the magazine i am running the 30 round mag for just a huge chunk of mobility and handling here we're moving fast around the map we're aiming down side super fast we're shooting fast off a sprint really quick and also if we need to reload i mean it's really quick as well so i do think that the 30 round mag is going to be your best choice here but if you really don't want to you can replace this attachment for something else and just keep it 40 rounds but in today's gameplay and i want to be fast around the map that 30 round mag is going to come in clutch here now for our final attachment before we hop into our tunes guys we are going to the rear grip and adding on the soldier grip for more sprint to fire speed and aim down side speed now getting into our tunes guys we are going to start with the barrel which i have my aim walking speed at 0.45 in my damage range maxed out at 0.40 now that's going to help us give us the most damage most range and also give us the most mobility when aimed down sight so if it's just moving while aimed down sight strafing left to right whatever it may be you are going to be moving faster and also our weapon has more damage more range which is going to be really good here now, for the Spiral Flash Hider, we are going to put our gun kick control at 0.17 and our aim down sight speed at 0.74. So we're going to be aiming down sights a little bit faster here, which is always good for any weapon that you tune like that. And then for our gun kick control, I do have a 0.17. Since this weapon does have a fast fire rate, it's not going to be kicking up as much. So it's going to be very easy to control, very calm. It's going to help you be more accurate. So you are going to be getting a lot more accurate kills. Now, jumping to the Bruin Warrior Grip, I do have my aim down sight speed at 0.17 and my hip recoil control at 0.59. So when hip firing, the weapon's a lot easier to control. You're going to see in today's gameplay if I'm hip firing. I mean, I can either hip fire or aim down sights, and it's really easy to control. Very accurate, and that's what I want here. And then for my aim down sight speed at 0.17. We are going to be aiming down sights pretty quick here. And then going into our final attachment, guys, the soldier grip. I have my recoil status at 0.77, my sprint to fire speed at 0.22. So we're getting a little bit more recoil control, a little bit more handling, just helping us be more steady, more aggressive. So that's what my build is. But for my class up overall, we have more damage, more range, accuracy, recoil control, mobility, and handling. You guys are going to love this class up. You can use it in pubs. You can use it in rank play, although you don't get the tunes for it. But, I mean, this build is really nice. I think you guys are going to love it. Now, I have two high kill games that you guys will enjoy. So, in the comments, let me know what you guys think about the build. Try it out and let me know what your highest kill game is. Thank you guys for watching. You guys stay safe, and I hope you enjoy. There we go. Yep. Yep. All right, let's see what we can do with this Vel 46. I'm sorry for not uploading. Um, I've been shadow banned. That's all. I mean, I, I could not play. They shadow banned me. Any account I got on was shadow banned. I mean, it, it was it was really a rough, like, last six days. I cannot lie. But I'm glad we're back. Now we can get in some games here and see what we can do here, really. Let's go ahead and place that sentry gun down. Hopefully, I get to play some of the new maps because I'm not going to lie, um, these, the new maps this season are really cool. I, I like them. Showdown's really good, and we already died. Come on, man. 
Hopefully, like, the people that we're playing against right now, they, you know... They allow us to let the game go on for a while, because, you know, I, I really don't want to... Really do not want to play, you know, five-minute hardpoint games. I really don't. Alright, let's keep this up. Man, I, and I also will say, like, I don't know if anybody watched the CDL this weekend, but... The matches were pretty fire, man. I... I did not expect New York to win. And hopefully going into the next season, it I hope it's fire, man. Really do. I don't I don't really think Optic will change their squad and I mean if anybody watches the CDL here in the comments, just let me know um what what teams do you think is all going to change cuz honestly I don't really see a lot of teams changing. I really don't. And it would be cool to get on a CDL team. As a content creator, I don't see myself, like, playing competitive. I used to want to play competitive, but honestly, my... I don't know, I just... I couldn't play, like, sweat 24-7, you know? Like, it, it's, it's difficult to do that. And plus, like, doing call-outs, like, for, like, a few hours, I mean, my head starts hurting, so... Alright, we do need to grab some scav packs. I forgot to put on... I forgot to put on the ammo box, so this might be a little rough. So I'm definitely gonna have to rely on getting definitely gonna have to rely on getting uh, scav packs, a lot of them. And wow, our second game on today. I mean, we have been cooking. Let's keep it up though. The M4 feels nice. It didn't get buffed, but definitely feels different. It might just be the build that I'm using, or I picked up. Alright, let's keep it up. Sentry gun's going crazy. That's good. I think I, I heard someone else shooting. There he is. And this is a weapon I wished was used in the CDL, because the MP7 is... I don't know. Like I feel like the mobility is a lot different on this than it is the Vaznav. I feel like you could move a lot more... And, I mean, we are cooking right now. The hip fire is okay on it. I mean, I think this is probably the best SMG as of right now. And why do I say that? Because it is better than the Vaznev now, just because... Since the Vaznev did get a little weapon nerf, I mean, it's... This weapon, it's, it's a GG now. You can cook with this weapon. Alright, let's keep pushing here. Let's just see the streak that we can go on. Hopefully we can break our little gun streak here. Maybe like a, get a little 60 gun streak in. We're on a 40 right now, so let's see if we can keep it up. All right. I have zero clue where people are going to be. I mean, we're, we're not going to... And of course I die. Oh, that's a GG. All right, let's keep it up. We do have an MGB in our pocket, so that is good. That is good. Run around here. There we go. Chuck that down. Yep. There we go. I wish this map was a little bit more open because I would use my VTOL. I would use a helicopter or something, but the map is just... It's just not open enough to use a VTOL or, like, a, a helicopter or anything. It sucks, but... I will say some of these maps do force you to have different streaks on, so I guess that's all right. Where's he at? Okay. Teammate, you almost just got gunned there, bud. Uh, can we pop it about right here? Yeah, teammate. Teammate, come on. There we go. I don't know what my teammate's doing. All right, there we go. There's a guy near me. There we go. All right, we need this counter UAV to go away so I can actually use my advanced UAV here in a second. Perfect. We are gonna push this way. I'm not. I'm. I don't think anybody's gonna push this way. So we we chilling. There he is. There he is. There must be in the middle because my sentry gun's gone. There we go. 
And this guy killed me again. We almost just got another nuke. There we go. Yep. We gotta heat up here, man. We gotta get we gotta get some more streaks in the air. And I really wish that you could overlap streaks. I mean, I, I hope next year's COD is just. I hope it's different. All right. And I, I really hope it rewards like really good people or like I, I just hope the game is completely different, man. And we almost just got a six piece, man. Oh my lord, we are cooking right now. There we go. There we go. Yep. Definitely getting our hands back and moving fast and everything. I mean, this is. I mean, this is a master class from us right now, so we're going to see how fast I can place this real quick. You just, I mean, I don't know what you're doing. There you are. You are going to be right there. Uh, I really don't know how to play this. There's a guy like Q. There's no point of going after one person. My sentry gun's shooting at me. Let me see. Is this guy gonna peek? Cause I mean, I'll wait. I mean, I'm a patient man. If that bomb germ kills someone, I'm gonna laugh. And it did. That is too funny. And we are cooking, man. Imagine someone doing that in some in the CDL. That would be insane. There we go. I mean, we are. Oh my lord. Someone signed me into the CDL right now. You know, although I, I play pubs a lot, I, I feel like I could do good in the CDL. I say that and then I get like absolutely smacked, but I honestly feel like I, I would do good. I mean, I just have to play a little bit, practice, know the callouts, and I mean, I think I think I, I could be good. I get I can get a, a ring. Now, nah, imagine. There we are. We got a little another jug. That is amazing. GG. Let's keep it. Oh, we're going to have to call this nuke in here. And we got 120 kills. Lord, how mercy. All right. I am not going to be able to call the nuke in. That is... Oh, I did. Okay, cool. Let's go. 120 kills. I haven't dropped 120 in a long time on this map. At first, this used to be one of my favorite maps. But, I mean, it's been a while. But, I mean, I have to say, our first game back, coming in crazy, going in crazy. I mean... Let's go, G G. And that's how you that's how you do a game right there. First game on with the MP7, G G. Game number two, and they're all running down here. What in the world? There's really no point of running down there. If you know, you're gonna die. You're gonna die. You know. I mean, this is a. Oh, was that? Is this Tempest Razorback? Let me go ahead and pick that up. All right, give this a reload. All right, GG. Already off onto a... You chasing me is not going to do anything for you. We have a good uh, sentry gun right there. A good spot for the sentry gun. Go ahead and call that VTOL in as well. So far, this is a... This is going to be a... I feel like this is going to be a good game. You don't know how to jump over stuff. Adios, buddy. All right, we are we are slaying here. All right, let's call this in. I want to see if that sentry gun stays in this spot, but it sounds like they're destroying it, so. Need to jump up here. Hey, I don't want y'all breaking my sentry gun, my man. I really don't. That is unfortunate. There we go. Bruh, what, what are we doing? We destroying sentry guns now? Is this what we're going to do? Is this what we're going to do, huh? 
We're gonna nade over there. You know, he really could have just knifed me and just went on with his day, but luckily he didn't. All right, let's keep this up. This is about to be a fast nuke. We got to plan this right, though. I'm going to grab the signal 50. There we go. I, I feel like this weapon, if it had a faster aim down sight speed, I, I feel like it would actually be a pretty fun sniper to use to quickscope with. But, I mean, you really can't do much with it. Is that a dude right there? No, he's dead. Jump up here. We'll, we'll, we'll look out here. We'll look out here. Really don't see anybody. Don't see anything going on. I feel like a noob just holding a sniper. I really do. Are they going to be here? Yep, I see them. Run through here. Losing Charlie. You know, what I'm going to do is I'll just run over here. And I'll just wait for these guys to just... What are you doing? Oh, I'm missing my shots. That's what I'm doing. All right, we got to find these people. I'm losing my momentum right now. We can't do that. We can't lose momentum. And I don't want to lose my dead silence. There we go. All right, on a 25. We're going to chuck that over there. No one's over there. Cool. There's that new skin. I, I really... I kind of want that skin. That's actually kind of fire. They're taking alpha. So they must still be spawning at A. I don't know. There we go. We're a few kills off. I'm kind of nervous. I'm not going to lie. I, I just I just don't want to die. I just want to get this nuke. Which way are you running? There we go. MGB. Shooting through that wall. Or the gate. I hate... You don't get aim assist sometimes through that gate. So you have to be careful. Alright, let me see what if I can do. See if I can get like a kill or two here. Never mind. Teammates are really not letting them cap here. That's why I'm not a big fan of Dom. I'm not a big fan of the domination. Not in this cut anyways. Black Ops... Three had a good domination. Ghost had a good domination. Most 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 CODs had a good dom, but unfortunately this one is just kind of booty cheeks. There we go. 674. I have to catch up on a week's worth of grinding, so that does suck, but you know, sometimes things happen for a reason. Which I, I don't know. I don't even know why I got Shadow Man. I I, I just I don't understand why people People just, I guess, can't accept people being good anymore. I, I guess that's, I guess, just that's something now. Back when I played COD, if someone was better than you, you you send them a friend request and you hope they added you as a friend so you could play with them. That's, or you just learn from getting punished. I mean, but I've been playing COD for a long time. I've been playing Call of Duty since I like online since I was pretty young. I was in. I was in middle school, 6th, 7th grade, and I mean, now I'm 24 years old, so I mean, it's it's crazy how long someone can play COD, or even how long someone, or how long a company can keep a game going, you know? And a kid from playing Call of Duty, you know, out of school, you know, you'd come home, make him a peanut butter sandwich, and start playing COD to, you know, doing as this as a career, it's, it's... It's, it's different. It, it it feels different. I'm dead. Never mind. You can't kill me. Can't kill me. Yeah, but guys, if you're still watching this video, let me know in the comments, like, how long have you been playing Call of Duty for? I'm sure there's a lot of older people that play COD, you know, and you've been playing as, like, you maybe you started while you were a younger adult or a teenager, but I don't want to die. I want to keep this flawless game. There we go. I do want to run over here. And get up here. Keep this flawless streak going on. There we go. I do need to reload this, but what I'm going to do... I'm just going to pick up this sniper. I feel like I'll be more consistent with this sniper. Maybe. I might be consistent with this sniper. I don't know. 
Let's see. There we go. There we go. I don't know. I'm I'm not a big fan of the the thermal scope. I will say. And there goes the flawless. Fifty eight and one, man. Come on. Come on. Come on. I have no idea where these people are gonna be. Okay, well that dude just got smoked. The only thing about having a 30 round mag, I mean there's pros and cons to this. You're reloading every time you get a kill or, I mean, reload every time you get a kill or two. I mean, but you can, you really can just melt the whole team with it, but. If you're accurate enough and up close. Because the time to kill is pretty quick. And this is why I wish this SMG was part of the CDL. Because I do think it is actually the best SMG. We get, we got to get upstairs. I got y'all. Hold on. I got y'all. No worries. This guy's trying to hit me with a sniper. Which he is doo-doo. Alright, let's call this in. Downed them. We're gonna chuck that in the smoke. And we're gonna put this sentry gun about right here. I feel like it'll probably be the best spot. I didn't even see him. Sometimes I forget that you can jump on that thing. Although I jump on it, I, I just sometimes I be forgetting. All right, let's jump up here. Jump up here. We do have a sentry gun up, so that's good. But we, uh, we're we going to have to start looking at the time because, I mean, we're already at 174. I have zero clue where these guys are going to be. They're not over here. I wasn't getting shot at there, bud. There's a guy here. There he is. How many kills were at? 72? I mean, we went on a 58 gun streak, and, I mean, we have to get some kills here. I mean... And this final stand has to be the most annoying thing here in COD. There we go. We're at 191. We're going to call this in pretty soon. All right. They're at, it's at 197 now. Yep. We're going to have to call the nuke in now. I mean, we went on a 58 little kill streak. I mean, I think we did something. All right. They're not over here. They're going to probably be over here. So let's see. There we go. I mean, this is this was a masterclass of a gameplay here. A little almost a 60 gun streak, kill streak, 83 kills on the new map. I think that's great.